What's going on, everybody? Welcome, welcome, and I like to say Happy Father's Day to all of the men who are fathers, whether it be biological, uh, father figure, uncle, big brother, all those fatherly figures in the world that help make the world better by the people that that you take care of. All right, and. With that being said, I want to talk a little bit about the role of a father, or I should say, one of the roles of a father. And this is just from my own experience being a father. What I've learned in being a father is that one of the roles that you play is for the future. I'll explain it like this. Many times as a father, when we're raising children, the children usually go to the mother for the comfort, right? They get a scratch, they get hurt, all stuff. They go, they, they, they go to the mother for the comfort, for the nurturing, as they should. Fathers, we nurture also. We we take care of things also, but our role really comes into full view in the future. We the way we teach. The way fathers teach, we don't teach for now. We don't instruct for now. We don't admonish for now. We don't heap praise for now. Our, our role really comes into full view in the future. See... When the, the way we teach, the way we instruct, the way we conduct ourselves as fathers, a lot of times when that when your child is actually a child, we seem like the bad guy, right? You know, it always seems like, you know, daddy is the mean one. Daddy is the scary one. Daddy is the one that, oh, don't mess with daddy. You know, when daddy comes home or I'm going to tell your father, when he comes home, he's going to deal with you. But actually, fathers, we're the goofy ones. We're actually the playful ones. But our role really hits home when that child becomes an adult. See, all those lessons that we gave when our children were young, to them, they probably see us as, oh, okay, dad's just talking, blah, blah, blah. He's always preaching about the same things. He's always getting on me stuff. He's always talking about, you know, when you get older, you know, you had, you had to do things now, so you have to worry about it later. You know, we always seem like the bad guy because we know that the things that we teach is really going to apply in the future. See, mommy deals with now. Daddy deals with later. That's usually how the dynamic is when it comes to parenting. Mommy deals with the issues of now. You know, your child got a scratch. Your child is crying about something. Mommy usually deals with that now. They're the nurturers. They deal with it. They nurture. They heal now. We instruct now, but it's meant for the future. See, when, I, when, I, when, I, when your child makes a mistake or messes up, we will instruct them. But we'll always say, okay, now, let's not do this in the future. Or let's say we've instructed our child, but they still make the same mistake. What gets us upset is not the fact that they made a mistake that happens. What gets fathers upset, the fact they make the same mistake when they were told in the past what mistake they made and how to avoid it. That's what the fathers get upset about. But didn't I just, t didn't I just tell you? So you, you ever heard that before? Your father say, didn't I d boy, look here, didn't I just tell you not to X, Y, Z? Didn't we just talk about this before X, Y, Z? How many times I gotta tell you X, Y, Z? See, our instructions are for the future. And how do we know that? When your child becomes a teenager, a young adult, or the biggest example is when your child is grown and they have a family and they have children of their own and then history repeats itself 
and all of the things that we as fathers taught the child when they were younger start to come back right all those instructions that we, that we put in all that did not tell you stuff all that prepare for get it now so you can worry about it later on all of that kicks in when the child becomes an adult and they're on their own because we know how the world works mothers do too but we see the world a little different we say okay let me give you the game now so you ain't got to worry about it later because as fathers and especially as, as men period we know that the roles are different the world treats you as a man differently there are certain expectations of you as a man and as a father and specifically as a black father so we understand and now we're going to as a black father we know as a black father i know as a black father what is expected of me what is expected of my children what is expected of other black fathers and also i know the reality of how the world deals with me and us as black fathers so our way of teaching is a little different yes we we can nurture i said we can nurture too but our lessons are mainly based around the future i see what's happening i know where it's going i know how it's going to end so how about this how about i give you the game now so when the future does come and you are still on this path the lessons that i taught you now will apply then now they can still apply right now but the full weight the full gravity of the lessons hit in the future that's when the, that's when your child has the oh wait dad did yeah he, he t yeah or have you ever just reflected on how you used yourself as a child you say you know what when i was a child my father told me x y and z when i was when i was a child my father showed me xyz when i was a child my father did xyz and then you start to realize wait a minute hold on daddy wasn't being mean daddy wasn't being evil he wasn't the bad guy daddy was actually a genius that man saw the future 20 30 40 years ahead and gave me the game daddy's a genius and that's when that's when the full role of fatherhood starts to really come into fruition and, oh wait a minute daddy wasn't just saying this stuff just to say it he was telling me these things for when I get older oh because because it always happens like if you mess up on something your father's voice come in have you ever have you ever just made a mistake a real bad mistake and you knew you you, you knew your mother was going we know your mother's gonna be cool but you heard your father's voice in your head how many of you ever made a big mistake and you heard your father's voice in your head with that same lesson that he told you in the past that it just kicked in your mind You're like oh shoot i know if i call my dad right now if i tell my dad right now oh i'm gonna get it because he already told me this i'm gonna i'm gonna get a lecture again you ever happened to me before see that's just one of the roles of a father so fathers have a lot of patience because we tell you stuff in the future so it takes a lot of patience to deal with the future but anyway, I just wanted to share that little nugget with y'all about fathers and one of the roles of a father. And this one's Happy Father's Day again to everyone. All the men out there in the world, you know, loving and taking care of their family. Appreciate y'all. Peace.